the time that I that I made my probably my worst program judgment of the I hope it was the worst I ever made was when John Mitchell who worked for Screen Gems and in those days it was a big deal to to get new it's, it's sort of like movies now when people read read uh, manuscripts in, in some early form in New York and 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 option material that later becomes a movie if you can get that first look at something and and get your hands on it, it occasionally you make a picture before that any no one, no one else can make and in those days that's the same thing happened with television shows and so you had relationships with people at agencies talent agencies and certain production companies and and you stroked those people and worked at those relationships so that they w might bring you something very very potential first and in this instance John Mitchell had brought a show to Walter Scott who was really the operating head of the company and Walter who had like Kintner great respect and I'm putting this in quotes because I have no idea why for my programming instincts called me it was about six o'clock at night and, and he said can you come up I want to I want you to look at something so we went, up, we went up to one of the screening rooms on the ninth floor or something and he said now nobody has seen this and, and I've got to give it back to John Mitchell tonight and give him a yes or a no we'll buy it or we won't buy it and uh, and and so I'm, I want your opinion well I looked at this thing and it and it was uh, it turned out to be bewitched and and very presentable and when the lights went up Walter turned to me and said what do you think and I said Walter it's one joke <laughs> you know, forget it and he so he's knowing nothing about programs himself not caring about programs he said to John Mitchell who wasn't there he called him up and he said we we pass and of course it went to ABC and was like a seven-year major hit for them